Alright, so we're Cold Connections, a small youth-led cooperative based right here in Worcester. And my name is Felix. I'm here to talk about the main problem that's happening globally. So big industrial companies that are taking over the food industry and they're treating their, their workers and their farmers very poorly. So because of this, such items like chocolate is expected to go into a food shortage within just a matter and a handful of years. So here, right here, there are no spaces for the youth in Worcester to learn about this, and that's where we come in. Hello everyone, my name is Daniel, and what we do to promote uh, food justice and the co-op business model in Worcester is by just buying from them. So what we do is we have been redistributing goods from a few co-ops around the city, and one of our uh, providers is Equal Exchange, which is a co-op I'm sure a few of you have heard. And all of our products are actually organic, so it's not bad for the environment, it's not bad for you, and they're sustainably harvested, so there won't be a shortage of it anytime soon. And it's fairly traded, which means it supports the workers' rights. Um, my name is Lacey Ann, and our market is uh, Worcester County. And based on uh, our market research that we conducted at Ultra Lunch in the Worcester Commons, we found that our real customers were coffee and chocolate lovers who supported youth empowerment. So we are one of the only co-ops in Worcester that is 100% youth-led. We're also one of the only co-ops that uh, sells or resells items from co-ops that wouldn't be able to reach customers around the city for reasons like there aren't, there aren't, they aren't very popular or they're out of the city, the state, the county, whatever. But we just get the, to the uh, customers. <laughs> Um, I'm Mary Nellis, and as Worcester Youth, we understand that the expansion of co ops can lead to a bright future for us. In 2018, Corporation Worcester is working on becoming a chapter of the United Federation of Worker Co ops. In order for this project to be successful, it needs more youth involvement, leadership, and planning. If you care about youth involvement and economic development and support workers' rights, we are asking for the chance to be more deeply involved in the cooperative movement in Worcester. You can meet us at the Worcester Roost.org or visit us at Stone Soup Community Center at Fort King Street. Also, we invite you to the stop by our table to buy organic products and t-shirts. Please and thank you. And uh, we'll be selling some coffee, lip balm, and t-shirts out there at the end of the presentation if you'd like to buy some. The prices are also out there. So. Thank you.